cottage cheese has been on vacation long enough. Today, we keep our recipe list growing and make a protein-packed cottage cheese pizza bowl that uses simple ingredients, is super easy to make, and absolutely delicious. So let's jump right into it. In every pizza video, I always like to ask you all what your favorite pizza toppings are so that maybe it'll inspire me to try something new. Drop them in the comments below. Start this by adding one and a half cups of cottage cheese into a mixing bowl. The most important step in this recipe is to use a cottage cheese that doesn't have a ton of liquid in it. In my experience, the lower fat or fat free ones work the best here. You could also drain your cottage cheese, but who actually wants to do that step? No! If you do, I'll put how to on the website along with the nutritional breakdowns with various cottage cheeses. The website, always linked up here or below in the description. Continue with one and a half teaspoons of Italian seasoning, three fourths a teaspoon of garlic powder, four tablespoons of grated Parmesan cheese, and a fourth a cup of your favorite pizza sauce. Mix those ingredients together until smooth. This next step is optional. However, if you hate the texture of cottage cheese, you can blend or process it until it's completely smooth like this. Personally, with it being pizza, I like the texture of the cottage cheese in it. Next, take out at least a 16 ounce baking dish and add in your mix. Sprinkle in a fourth a cup, some mozzarella, and mix that in. Last, top it with a fourth a cup of some more mozzarella and optional pepperoni slices. I like to cut mine up so that it's easier to get pepperoni in every bite. Alternatively, if you double or triple the recipe and use a bigger dish, whole slices work great too. Throw that into the oven on 400 for around 15 to 20 minutes or until your cheese on top is melted. In the end, it should look like this. Couple tips to this one. Number one, as it cools out of the oven, it'll thicken up a bit more. The only downside to using a cottage cheese that has more liquid in it is that your bowl will be more soupy. <sighs> However, it'll still taste great. Number two, add whatever else you want into your mix. Chopped up vegetables, crushed red pepper for a kick, and so on. Number three, if you like cold pizza, you can also eat this cold. Let's get weird! The winner of our last testing your guest meeting for the blueberries was Bang! Congrats to you. For this week's testing your guest meeting, we're gonna go with this much pepperoni. Guess how much you think it weighs in grams, and the first one closest to it will win a shirt or shaker. One guest per person. With that said, thank you all for watching. Hit that thumbs up button for more cottage cheese recipe ideas. Subscribe if you haven't already, so you never miss a recipe. Don't forget to check out theproteinchef.co for all your healthy recipe needs, and of course, stay healthy.